The new scrubber stack at Leland Old Station is unlike Basin Electric's other power plant stacks. This one will carry the flue gas from two units. The unit two comes in from the south side and unit one comes in from the north side. This stack is different in another way. Most other stacks taper as they get to the top. This one doesn't. That was to make it simpler to get both flues into one chimney. But since everything is fitting into the same cylinder, basically, it made more sense to keep it a continuous diameter. When you stand at the top of the stack, you're 580 feet above the ground. The flues stretch another 20 feet beyond that. Each flue is made of 30 foot tall canisters. They basically brought each can in one at a time and they raised, would raise one can up 30 feet and then they would join another can to the bottom of that. They would fiberglass weld the joint basically and then they would keep, keep raising the cans up from the top until they were all the way out the top of the chimney. The material is laminated fiberglass, not brick, like the stacks that are used now at Leland Olds. The canisters are about an inch thick, but at the places where they're hung inside the chimney, they're about six to eight inches thick. They're basically hung from an interior platform at the 555 foot elevation. And then there's also an expansion joint at 185 feet. So everything, everything above 185 is hung at 555. And there's a support again below 185. And then there's a support again where it exits the chimney. It was the beginning of April when the flues were brought into the stack. All fiberglass work should be finished by the end of July. There's still electrical work and work on the elevator to complete. The plan is to have it finished by October. At Leland Old Station, I'm Tracy Bettenhausen.